Hi, my name is Mike Wills. I've been fishing the waters of the Chesapeake Bay, uh, primarily the Lower Bay area in the Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel since 1994, uh, which was uh, one of the first years, I believe, after they lifted the moratorium on rockfish. And uh, used to be a blast uh, come um, October 4th, I think it was, get out there and, and catch them until your arms feel like they're gonna fall off, uh, especially at night in the light lines of the Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel. They'd be uh, hitting uh, on the large schools of uh, uh, bait fish like Menhaden along Chesapeake Bay Bridge Tunnel. Then of course the uh, ocean fishery was a lot of fun where you'd go out there and find the beehives of birds just diving on large schools of bunker and catching um, you know, nice sized rockfish during the winter time. Um, flounder fishing was also quite um, robust as well. We used to be able to go out there and drift fish the old Chesapeake Bay sandwiches and um, you know catch a, a few flounder for the, the dinner table as well. But uh, I've seen both of, both of those fisheries drop off dramatically in the last uh, 30 years uh, as the uh, uh, schools of Menhaden have all but disappeared from the bay. I go out there and fish uh, at least once a week during the weekday when uh, there's not as many boats out there and very seldom do we ever see the large schools of Menhaden out there anymore. Um, it, it's it's um, very tragic what's happened to the uh, health of the Chesapeake Bay ecosystem with the lack of the uh, forage fish in the Chesapeake Bay um, with those two prize sport fish. Um, so anyway, I've all but given up. Uh, now I just uh, take my boat down to Florida for the winter time and uh, you know, enjoy some success down there because uh, our winter fishery is basically uh, dead up here and not much left in the summertime either, unfortunately. So hope we can uh, make some changes and, and uh, get the Menhaden uh, uh, harvest, harvesters out of the Chesapeake Bay. Thanks.